Hi everyone, welcome to chapter one in Adolescent Development. This is where we start off the course and the basic question we're focusing on here is what is adolescence? What does it mean now? What has it meant historically and how has it changed? Uh, we're going to take a very applied approach to this chapter. That is, we're going to start by talking about our own adolescence. What were we as adolescents? What were we good at? What were we bad at? So the focus here is really on three aspects of adolescence, three ways in which we change in adolescence. One is physical. How do we change physically? How do our bodies change? How do our brains change? Two, how do we change cognitively? How do we change in how we think and how we uh, develop our morals? And three, how do we change in terms of our social and emotional responses to things? How do we develop friends? And how do our relationships with family change? And how is it that we respond emotionally to events? Now, all three of these domains of the development that we're going to talk about with adolescents are all surrounded by our environment. It's really important to understand the environment in which adolescents grow and change because our environment impacts how we change physically, how we change in terms of our thinking, our cognition, and how, do we, how we develop socially and emotionally. So chapter one is going to be a basic introduction to adolescence, focusing on your adolescence and starting to understand these main domains of a development, physical, cognitive, social, emotional, and the environmental context, which includes culture. So I look forward to talking with you about what you think adolescence is and whether it's similar or different to how adolescence was 100 years ago. See you soon. Bye.